This is what I've been most excited for. <laughs> Cheetos. They're Cheetos, but they're um, they're it, there's like peppers and garlic on them. Yeah. Um, it says, and they're from South Korea, for the record. Crunchy chips with a mixture of sweet, spicy, and vegetable flavors. And it's called hot and sweet. Hot and sweet Cheetos. Yeah. Yeah. I'm... <laughs> okay. I don't like these. I can't open them. There you go. You did it! <laughs> Ooh, these are a lot lighter than normal Cheetos. Yeah, I don't know. This this is funky looking. I mean, you guys know what Cheetos looks like, and they're not usually not usually like that. That's weird. This is vegetable ramen noodle Cheetos. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Good call again. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I like those. Yeah, they're a little bit too spicy. Good. I mean, that sucks. <laughs> now I'm going to have to eat them all by myself. Oh, wow, that's so bad. <sighs> Whoever put together this box, it's stellar tough. work. Yeah, this is, all of this stuff is so good. By the way, his name is Nick. Oh. Made for you. Didn't even read that. Right. <laughs> Made just for you by Nick. Thanks, Nick. <laughs> yeah, Nick's a nice guy. He knows his candy. So next thing is a fruit raspberry chewy candy strips from Germany. I know some of you are from Germany. I know a lot, a lot of, of you. Of your I was Germany. about to say, you know, a lot of. A lot so of maybe you know this one. Wait, can you see it? Maybe you know that one. Yeah. Fruit. 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 I don't know if they roll their R's so. though. Fruit. Fruit. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Look at us. Look, Look at, at us go. Okay. This is weird packaging. It is. It looks like a really big stick of uh, Wrigley's chewing gum. Yeah. Yes, it does. Oh, this is. We could have shared one of these. Yeah. Do you, well, let's just do that. Yeah. Fine. Wait. No. This is how we do it. Okay, I found can do it that way. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> it looks like my tongue. Wait. Get out of the way. Mmm. So how do you feel? I think it's good. Mm. It's definitely different. It's kind of chewy, but it doesn't feel like like it's chew it and it feels like it's supposed to like dissolve in my mouth. Yeah. But I feel like it's never ever gonna dissolve. Mine's dissolving quick. Oh. We <laughs> got a lot of juice. Got a lot of juice, yeah. Um, tastes like a, a strawberry milkshake. Mm. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like this a lot. Yet again, Nick, yeah. you're killing it, buddy. I like this a lot, but this is kind of weird right after the Cheetos. <coughs> you okay? Yeah. Um, so this is. High Thai baked potato flavor biscuits. Sounds it's an interesting, interesting name. But for anybody that knows, um, they look a lot like Paki from Japan, which is a snack that I used to eat a lot when I was little and lived in Japan. Yeah, fun fact. Jackson used to live in Japan. Yeah, I'm a I'm a Navy kid, so we were we've been all over. But this this looks exactly like Paki, but I never would have um never would have imagined that it was translated to a biscuit snack. Some, I don't know. I'm just going fast. Not me. I'm excited. Cheers. Oh my god, this smells like dog treat. Mmm. <laughs> a lot crunchier than Pocky. I don't know about those. No, I don't like these very much. I don't, I don't think I do either. They, mm. what, what is the flavor? What did I say they were? Baked potatoes? Baked potato flavor. High Thai. Probably saying that wrong. You South Korea kids, you're wild. I'm gonna eat two more of this one, though. <laughs> of course you are. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next one that we are going to eat is one that I'm really excited about because I love Kenda and I really wanna go to Kenda. It's from Kenda. <laughs> <laughs> it. It's gold. Whoa, I'm impressed. 
we did it. All by myself, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Rip Van Waffle Strawberry Flavor, right? Is that yeah. how you say that? Killed it. Killed it. And it's from Canada, and it's strawberry flavored. I don't know why it'd be strawberry flavored. I actually didn't know that. Ooh, these are sticky. <laughs> oh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, I'm into that. Do you guys see that? Go Canada, go! It's dripping. That's honestly exactly what I would have would have hoped for from a Canadian treat. You know, because of all the maple syrup. Yeah. Hmm. Honestly, I feel like I would like this better if it was just like maple syrup flavored. Yeah. Just like didn't really have much of a flavor. It's pretty good. But I think I would have, I think I would have liked it better without the strawberry. Yeah, I think so too. Um, also, this is it's crazy because it's like like you see how like thin it is and it's not mm -hmm. that big. But I feel like one of these would fill me up. Yeah. I like I wouldn't be able to eat more than one of this. Yeah. Not because it's like not good. Or, but because it's like really filling. It's like yeah, it's really really rich. Yeah. One more. Yeah. Yeah, but I definitely agree. If it would be just like normal maple syrup. Not strawberry flavor. Especially it's, since it's like a waffle. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So we got two left, and the one of them is also a waffle flavor. So we're gonna skip that one, so we don't do two of those in a row. We're not but, gonna skip it. We're just gonna do the next. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very true. The uh, our next thing is Lion Ramoon soda candy. I'm not sure exactly um, how you are supposed to say that, but it's from Japan, and it's a uh, soda flavored candy. It has like a consistency that I feel is gonna be like pop rocks kind of, like? or like rock oh, candy. I love like the ones that like. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Like but these are like big. They feel like. Yeah. True. Japan usually kills it though on the candy. Yeah. Yeah. At least, at least in my experience, when I was little. Hmm. So they, they're they about like the, they look kind of like uh, Warheads. If you guys know what Warheads are, the little it's sour kind of candies. Like, yeah, like hard candy. Yeah, looks like. Mm. You just chewed it right away? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. This is a little bit like soap. Yeah, like really sweet soap. Mm -hmm. I mess around with this. I like this though. I haven't chewed it yet. Mm. Is there stuff inside it? Oh, I think it's better once you chew into it. Yeah. Because the outside does kind of have like a little bit like of a soapy something flavor, but it's a lot sweeter when you mix it around. Get the whole get the whole experience, the whole lion yeah. experience. Raw. Yeah. No. Okay, so the last one that we are doing today, our last snack from our munch pack. <laughs> Just throw it on the floor, God. There's no reason I should have done that. Lotte Waffle Mat. Right? From South Korea. Last thing that would taste from South Korea. It's, I think I would say that that's probably... Looks like Latte. Latte oh. Waffle Mate. I don't know. I don't. Exactly. I have no idea what that what that means, but... <clears throat> Jackson is better in the pronouncing stuff, if you haven't realized. Only, only because we're not speaking Icelandic. We should play this game with Icelandic candy and see who does better. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> nice. We should just share one, right? Yeah. Okay. We'll keep the second one for for our trip home. For our trip home. Ooh, can we save it? Mm. Mm. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited about this one because this one seems really good, but the last one that we had from South Korea was not good. Mmm, it oh, also I smells think. good. Yeah, it does. So the um the other waffle thing we had, like we mentioned, was strawberry. No, I'm talking about this from South Korea. No, I was. Oh, I was sorry, sorry. sorry. No, I'm it's sorry. okay. I was just saying the last waffle thing that we had from Canada was um strawberry flavored, and I think this one is just honey. Let's see, let's see. Ooh, it's a lot more wafery, crispier. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. This is good. This tastes like a, um, a vanilla wafer. Pretty much have vanilla wafers. Vanilla really wafers good. with a little bit of um, coconut taste to it. Yeah, it has a little bit of coconut taste. Yeah. 
Mm, that that's is up. really good. Yeah, that one's really good. Good job, South Korea. <laughs> You've redeemed yourself in the <laughs> eyes of Disa. <laughs> mm. I have oh, another cool. one. Yeah, I, I would too. So, Disa, how would you, you know, if you're offering, <laughs> sure. How would you, how would, yeah. So, Disa, how would you describe your munch pack experience today? Top notch. Top Even notch. though all of them weren't like, like you guys saw, I did like all of the candies. Yeah. But it's so much fun like tasting it from like different parts of the world and being able especially to like read it in English and be like, you know, where, where it's from and yeah. what's, it, what's the ingredients and all that. Yeah, but it also it also says it has a feature with a scanner so you can like scan the barcode on whatever you like and then you can get that shipped directly to you. So Oh yeah. Once you like once you find something that you would probably never find otherwise by yourself unless yeah. you just went there and happened to stumble across it, you can like find whatever candy or whatever snack you want from whatever yeah. corner of the world and boom, you can get it this. shipped to you. This is definitely the my favorite one. You think so? Yeah, that one's definitely my favorite. I really I really like the um honestly I really really mess around with this uh the sour the power sour belt thing, yeah. And I really like the Cheetos. Oh yeah. I like most of the stuff. I like yeah. I would eat any of this stuff again. Me too, any me too of actually. Actually yeah. even yeah. these even these they're growing on me. I I'd, I'd eat them if like somebody had them. You yeah. know, if somebody had them, I'd like, hey, can I have some? You know? Yeah. Why not buy them though? No, I probably wouldn't buy them. That's cool. Good. Well, definitely would recommend trying this out if you guys are yeah. down for experiencing and a little bit of other cultures. Things. Yeah. Food. Yeah. And you can do it safe, especially if, if you're somebody that doesn't usually get to do stuff like that because you have an allergy or, yeah, exactly. or a dietary restriction yeah. of some sort. That's, I think it's that's really like, cool. yeah, that's super cool. And also make sure to use our code. It will be down below because yeah. I mean, even though it's maybe not a super amount, it's still better than nothing, you yeah. know? Yeah, that's true. So again, lastly, we just wanted to reiterate, we do have the PO box now. So, Open to all. Yeah, the postcard thing is a really cool idea. Yeah, I think so. Cause I mean, it doesn't, I won't, won't cost you no. other, anything other than like a couple cents and we would love it. And we will probably end up putting that like on a wall that we can use yeah. as like a background or maybe we're gonna do a, a van life thing. We'll get more into that in later videos. But yeah. that'd be a really cool thing to put like on one of the walls in the van. Yeah, yeah. Having like from all kinds, of yeah. all places of the world. Yeah. All, all different places of the world. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. um, or also like having a postcard that has the flag. You yeah, know what I mean? true. Then we have like all different flags and I think that'd be so cool. But definitely check that out. Uh, buy up both our PO box and the uh, discount code, and all the information will be down below. Yep. And as always, all of our social media, everything's also down below if you want to check it out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> definitely like the video if you liked it, and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of our videos. It's a good call, Disa. Yeah. Good advice. Yeah? yeah, right? Wouldn't you do it? I think I would. I think I would too. Yeah. I think you should too. Probably. Right? Um, that's pretty much it. Yeah. If you're going to sleep, wait, no, wait, uh. <laughs> Anyways, if you're going to sleep, have a good night and just woke up, make sure to have a good day. It's important. Peace. <laughs> Deuces.